Hello guys, what is up? In this video, I am going to be shaving my hair. That's right. So I have alopecia areata. I don't know why it's such a complex. Anyway, I have alopecia and I'm going to be shaving my hair off in front of you guys, which I think is quite cool. Um, quite empowering maybe. I know it's harder for girls to lose their hair. What I'm going to do, if you want to skip straight to the hair shaving, I'll give a, a time you can skip to, but I'm just going to tell you a little bit about my story with alopecia. So I noticed my first like bald spot at work um, end of 2016. So I'm talking about when I first had my hair coming out like the first time not not it coming out now so if it's i didn't clarify that sorry about the confusion beginning of 2017 uh 2017 was just like a really hard year in general it was just so bad it was the first time my hair was falling out so it, it was definitely in a worse place to go bald because for me back then i would never have dreamed of having short hair i've always had long hair with a with a with a fringe that covers like one eye it's just always been like that like i always liked having my hair like that uh, so when i had to shave it it was a bit of a shock when your hair is falling out in huge quite aggressive huge clumps um you know you you get sick of it and that's why i shaved it off and yeah i definitely felt uglier um for me we're all different you know what i mean and it's just scary for a girl to lose the hair i just saw like my big forehead and stuff like that and i just didn't like it i would wear hats i couldn't wear wigs so i would just wear a bandana wigs were just unbearable for me i just would go into the bathroom and just have to scratch my head like crazy it was hard but then it grew grew back it was fun having it short i kind of like it like this like i kind of liked having a shaved side and like a fringe thing i was like really liking this look but unfortunately this year it's come out again as you can tell obviously it's come out it's not come out as, as aggressively as it did last time and i'm already getting hair growth and i'm definitely in a better place to go bald this year because i don't know although i'm not really that successful back then like i, I couldn't drive um i wasn't very good at music back in 2017 i think i proved a lot i had nothing out I, I was still finding myself as a musician i feel like i found myself as a musician and finding like other things about myself as well that i enjoy so I'm, i definitely feel like i'm in a better place to have this shave and i've been bald before so it doesn't scare me anymore and hopefully there's you know that element that it will grow back again so i'm hoping it will and this might be just something that happens every three or so years and something I'll just have to deal with. People always ask me, oh, have you been stressed? I'm like, I'm always stressed. So it's like, I mean, I'm stressed, but I'm no different to st being stressed when I have hair. So I think it's just something, a problem with me in general. My, I've got um, lots of like uh, autoimmune system diseases. I've got IBS, an overactive thyroid. And everything like that so yeah just it's it just must be that really oh skin condition as well like it's just i've got a lot wrong with me when it comes to autoimmune stuff so it's probably something to do with that so yeah i've decided to shave my head because i'm really getting sick of it in my food in my mouth or just everywhere but as this this is new hair i feel like the rest of it, it just wants like an like a like a snake shed in its skin it just wants a new new growth so i'm gonna grant it with that um, i'm also raising donations i've spoken to the, a company called the long hairs on instagram they've been they're very nice people uh, they're from san diego things for charity for for hair loss because they're a hair company we forward to a donation link so if you feel generous children with hair loss us so you can donate quite easily on that website i'll leave it in the description below if you're feeling generous so yeah let's get to some shaving shall we oh my god oh hiya Sorry about this is terrible quality, but the window's behind me, so it's not going to be the best quality. And welcome to the bathroom. I'm kind of whispering because my voice echoes quite a bit, and my dad works pretty much the room next door with his door open. I think I'm talking to myself like some nutcase. He doesn't really understand what I do. So, Lisa, again, with no surprise, uh, I've never done this before, but I never do anything for the first time on any of my videos. Yeah. I'm just going to put it on the ponytail and I just cut it what's there off this looks completely mental breakdown-y doesn't it I'm going to turn it back now you should 
see the hair on the floor. They made a massive mess of this bathroom. This is not good. I'm surprised the amount of hair I've got left considering like it falls out every day. Carol basket. I look like an e-boy now. Uh, what would you like? Uh, just, just it up. Oh my god. This is gonna be a long video, guys. Don't ever lie and feel like you're close to 2007 Britney because I think this is pretty close, to be honest. I think I'm going to change this to a shorter one. Oh, I don't like Sinead O'Connor. That feels weird. Oh, isn't it without the uh, thing on it now? It's got to be so careful. That is my hair, my hair, all of my hair. Oh my God, I really hope I can get this clean. See Daisy? I look like a tiny little egg. Seriously, my head looks so small. I look like a little, little tiny little egg. I'm just reminded how large my ears are, how big my forehead is. Love yourself, right? Big thanks to my friend Kat, who let me borrow that razor. She had to cut her kid's hair, but she let me borrow it real quick, so I appreciate that. Thanks for putting it in hold for me. Someone pointed out I look at the screen and not the camera. It's not me being vain. Well, I can't stop looking at this bald head, but usually it's not me being vain. It's just literally because I'm like a bit ADHD or whatever. Like it's, it's, it's a flashy thing that makes me want to look at it. I am trying to look at the camera more. I do apologize. Before we finish this video, I just want to do a big shout out to my sister. So as I said, I don't, I don't use wigs. I don't, didn't want to use wigs because they're really uncomfortable from, from the last time. So my, I thought this sort of like, hair extension in a hat, in a really thin hat sort of combo. Uh, I couldn't find any cheap, my idea, my hair. I managed to get some hair extensions and a beanie. My sister used her sewing skills and made me something. That's a bit of a mess because it's been in a bag for a while, but we're gonna try and uh, attempt to wear it. So yeah, that's what she did. Um, I'm gonna cut it down to size. Yeah, it just feels a lot lighter than your average wig, to be honest. And I'm gonna cut it down to about here, I think, anyway. You would hardly know I'd ever shaved my hair. <laughs> Thanks so much, guys, for watching. Even if you just skipped through, I do appreciate it a lot because it really helps my channel grow. I hope you enjoyed me shedding my hair. Until next time, bye.